You said that to be happy is to be blind. What does this mean in the age where everyone wants to be happy and uh, where every kind of books try to sell us uh, how to be happy? Yes, well, I once wrote a uh, book called Happiness in which I imagined a young woman obtaining a visa to visit paradise. <laughs> And she went and visited all the people in paradise and said, are you happy? <laughs> and uh, all the people she met in paradise were real people. It was a historical, okay. solid information. And I saw that uh, the people, most of the people in paradise were too tired to be happy. They just wanted to sleep. And I think most people are now too tired. We are life is very strenuous and so your ambition is quite limited and so what happiness means is how to get out of the stress of life how the increasing demand for efficiency um, so all our organization is making life a struggle against the demands of get more money and so on um, and even if people get what they want they um, you know, there's still other things which they don't know about and their lives are not complete. And so you might say you're very happy and you've got two children and two, a dog and a house and, you're, and that is all you want from life, but you're only half alive and you haven't been fully alive. And uh, it seems to me that uh, happiness is a, a dream and uh, you cannot be happy if you see that in most of the world there is so much misery and so much poverty yeah. and so much stupidity and viciousness and oppression, how can you be happy if you think only about yourself? This is, this is not happiness, this is illusion. So, uh, which is your way to be happy? By talking to others? I, I don't try to be happy because <laughs> when I see all these millions of people yeah. whose homes have been destroyed and they have done nothing wrong and then an airplane comes and drops, drops a bomb on their, on their home. It is absolutely tragic, tragic, tragedy, it's ridiculous. How can any, anybody in the world be happy with what is going on now?